well how to balance c2 a6 plus o2 that produce h2 plus co2 this is the complete combustion of ethane so in the right hand side we have carbon which is one and then we have hydrogen which is two and then we have here we have one oxygen and here we have two oxygen so basically we have here three oxygen so now uh, look here oxygen is present in two compounds so we'll balance oxygen at last so we'll try to target the atom that is present in one compound so let us target carbon first here two here one so to balance carbon you can simply multiply here by two that gives you two if you multiply by something that something must come before the atom that is before the carbon this carbon has come from here so we have to place here two if you place here two the number of carbon is two the number of oxygen here will be this is subscript this is coefficient so two times two four so here you have to sense here four so now you have five oxygen now here carbon two two is balanced here hydrogen is six here two so to balance hydrogen simply you can multiply here by three that gives you six if you multiply by something that something must come before the atom that is here and this hydrogen has come from here so you have to place here three so if you place here three the number of hydrogen three times two six the number of oxygen here will be three that is you need to change here three so three plus four that gives you seven right so hydrogen is balanced but here oxygen is two here seven so you need here seven uh, oxygen right seven oxygen so that is why uh, you need to make this seven as a numerator and to cancel this two you need to take two as a denominator these two these two cancel each other so you you will get seven and so seven over two this will come before this oxygen atom that is here but look th this is uh, seven oxygen seven oxygen then six hydrogen six and everything is balanced so you can say that this is the balanced equation but here we have a fraction so we need to multiply this whole equation by two so here you have to place here two and if you multiply here seven two two times seven over two that is seven so you have to place here seven then here three times two you have to write here six then two times two you have to write here four so this is the actually balanced equation